Electricity Robotics Arcade Game Class Project. This is an original 1981 Moon Patrol game that was given to me. In pretty bad shape. A rebuild is necessary. Here's the old picture tube in its original housing. Here's the original control board. Compare this thing to a handheld GameCube. An overall side shot of everything. First thing we did was get rid of that old picture tube. Notice that the metal bracket is still in place. Here's a shot of that bracket removed. All controls removed and cleaned up. I'm utilizing an old computer that I had, so we're going to custom fit the original bracket to a computer monitor. Foam padding installed on the sides for protection. With some screws and scrap wood, we managed to fit the original bracket to the computer monitor. Here's the monitor in the cabinet with its custom housing. Front side of the original joysticks and push buttons. And here's the rear view of these old controls. Here's the new controls, all access joysticks and push buttons. After removing the old controls, students had to drill the holes a little bit bigger for the new controls. New controls getting installed. Everything fits like a glove. Since I'm recycling some of the old wire, we use the meter to check everything out. A computer speaker will be housed in the change box area. Here's a close-up view of the push buttons with the limit switches in place. Wiring all the new controls together to communicate with the computer. Here's the old computer tower at the bottom and an old refurbished multi-outlet strip to power everything up. Keyboard and mouse in place. We cleaned up and tested the old Player 1, Player 2 controls, so I'm going to keep using those. Inside the change box area is the computer speaker. Installed in the computer is Return of Arcade Classics. Here's the cabinet all buttoned up, lid closed, and those controls blend right in. Here's my best friend Irv testing the whole thing out. We grew up playing these games. Currently, he's a doctor and makes more money than anybody I know, and he wouldn't put quarters in the game to play. Here's one of the favorite parts for me. If you were to buy this cabinet from someone else, you'd pay about $2,600. Total cost for this project, under $300. Would someone please tell this guy it's time to go home?